Hi friends, now we we'll discuss today development theory, you know, study geography and development theories, some of the important development theories like metals, cumulative causes and theory. Okay, metal in 1956 argued that regional differences and differences are the natural outcomes of economic development. So middle 1956, Ford argued that the, re the regional differences are the natural outcome of economic development. So here a regional development difference is important for natural outcome of economic development. And the inevitable result of market forces, no one region can prosper. He said, he said without adversely affecting the, pr the prosperity of another. Economic growth takes, uh, takes place in a city where there are, there are such natural advantages as a source of fuel or a supply of raw material. So here important things, so here no one region uh, can prosper, he said, without adversely affecting, affecting the prosperity of another. Economic growth take place, takes, uh, takes place initially where there are such natural advantages as a source of fuel or supply of raw material. Once in existence, once in existence, this region of economic development states and measure the process of cumulative, cumulative, cumulative again. Okay? So economic development was uh, set in motion the, the process of cumulative condition. In effect, centripetal force began to operate uh, whereby capital and labor. So here centripetal force begin to operate whereby capital and labor are, are, are affected, attracted into the expanding area so here real capital and labor are attracted into the expanding area which further simultaneous okay stimulates which which further stimulates its prosperity of the expense of the surrounding region okay so here labor here in fact, in effect, centripetal force began to operate to fair by capital and labor are attracted into the expanding area, uh, which for the simultaneous its prosperity of the expanse of the surrounding regions. At the same time, by the multiplier effect, growing industries okay, produce other secondary industries. Growing industries produce other secondary industries which are different, dependent on the original areas. Together, together with impo improved transport facilities and sector and social sectors. Social service. Okay. The chain acts reacts the chain reaction process self-sustaining economic growth. So here at the same level, it has a multiplier effect. Growing the surrounding regions at the same time by the dip by the by. So secondary industry okay, growing industries produce other secondary industries which are developed on the original ones together with improved transport facilities and social services. This uh, chain reaction produces self sustaining economic growth, middle care called the movement of wealth. Uh, uh, model called the movement of wealth from the proper the, from the poorer region to the central region the backwards effect it it takes place become of the better facilities and opportunities offered by the growing regions the aggregate the aggregate with the differences differences further a rich area may flood and makes markets of the poorer poorer areas are cheap so cheap products thereby preventing the latter from developing their own industries the results is an industrially expanding region on the one hand and st and stagnating or even declining regions on the other eventually the increased wealth 
in the initially developed area would percolate. The increased, or increased wealth in the initially developed area would percolate downwards to the less developed area. The middle Christian has the spread effect or trickle down from the core. An expanding economy may increase the demand of raw materials and agricultural products derived from poorer regions and will create surplus control which can be invested in newly developing areas. Advanced technology might also be different in the fields of the every wider, wider area. In this way, the economics, economics of the poor regions may be similar stimulated and the process of cumulative collisions thereby triggered of the of it in those parts those parts. So here you can see the location of the industry and expansion of employment and population developing of external economics from farmer products from farmers products and okay so here you can see the provision of better industries for better for population and industrial development, roads, facilities, factories, sites, public utilized health and education services, etc. Expand, expansion of government funds increased through increased illegal tax yield, expansion of general wealth of community, expansion of services, industries and other theory and theory can be in, it's in location of the new industry here, expansion of the employment okay, and population. Mm -hmm. Increase in pet pool, pool of trained industry labor, attraction of capital and enterprise to exploit expanding demands for poor and poor, poor demands for goods and services, and expansion of services industries and others, and expansion of general wealth community, and expansion of government funds, government tax. Okay, so all are now here roundly moving. So here development of an ancillary industry to supply farmer formal with inputs, development of external economics for formal production. So there are there are uh, the so there are there for the three stage regional differences a peri a um, pre industrial stage where a few regional inequalities a second stage when when one region is one region is in advancing fast faster than the than other regions and hence the uh, imbalance of wealth at the t at its general and a third stage when it, it the spread effect begin to reduce the social special difference. So we understood it and we can if you see again firstly until nineteen fifty six argued its so regional regional differences come from natural uh, regional differences are the natural outcome of the economic development. Okay. So here is the inevitable result of market forces. So no one region can prosper. Okay. She said that without adversely affecting the prosperity of prospect of another. Economic growth takes place initially where there are such natural advantages. Okay, such natural advantages as a source of level of supply level or source of fuel or fuel supply of raw material once in existence that this region is economy of economic development sets in motion, process of cumulative causation, in effect, in effect, centrifugal force begin to operate, uh, uh, operate uh, whereby centrifugal force area, okay? So, here, uh, where, uh, whereby capital and, capital and labor are attracted into the expanding area, okay? So, which further stimulates its prosperity at the expanse of surrounding areas in that first time, that is the multiplayer, Planar, uh, multiplier effect. Growing industries grow, produce others, uh, produce others. Secondary sector, secondary industries which are dependent on the original areas, uh, together with improved transfer facilities and social services. So the chain reaction of this self ecosystem economic growth. Middle like called its movement of the wealth from the poorer regions to the central rich regions. In the backwards effect. It takes place in Bahia because, because the better facilities and opportunities offered by the growing region to aggregate the differences further. A rich area may be plot at the markets 
and of the poorer areas with cheap products. Okay, they may prevent preventing the latter from developing their own industry. The result the result is an industrially expanding region on the one hand and strengthening and stagnating or, or de even declining regions on the other. So eventually eventually as the increased wealth is in the initially developed area. Okay, the developed area would per uh, percolate downwards to the less developed areas. Okay, this uh, this middle uh, this middle Christian Christian at the at the spread effect. So a uh, trickle down from the core. So as expanding economy and may increase the demands of the raw material and agriculture products devised from poorer regions. Okay. Yes, and will create surplus of capital with which can be instead will developing areas. Okay, advanced technology might also be diffused all over the over the ever wider area. In this way, the economics on the on the poorer regions may be stimulated, and the poorer of cumulative position thereby triggered off. Okay, in those parts. So we understood it, and after we if we discuss it, we discuss it again. So labor uh, uh, from new industry and expensing uh, employment. Um, Industry increase, okay. Industry goods and services attraction, okay. and uh, here demands increase and expansion of services, expansion of regional wealth, of government, government funds, okay. So here all are increases now, okay. Cyclic, cyclic way, way. So I think it will help you. So complete now. So thank you for.